Eczema is a chronic skin condition that affects people of all ages and can have a significant impact on a person's quality of life. Skincare company Balmonds has developed an extra gentle balm to support individuals with eczema to keep their sensitive skin in good condition as well as promoting a healthier well-being. Lucy Gulland, PR and Community Manager at Balmonds, and Ruth Holroyd, who's a Balmonds brand ambassador and award-winning blogger on eczema and allergies, join me now. Thanks both very much for joining us. Lucy, Balmonds has developed products specifically for individuals with extremely sensitive skin. What are the products and what was the reason behind their development? So the reason was really born out of necessity. Um, uh, a mom needed to find something that worked on her little daughter's very, very sore, extra prone skin. And she just couldn't find anything. Everything that she was offered, everything she could find over the counter, stung, made it work, that aggravated um, the condition. So she just set about um, mixing up a, a, an ointment herself out of completely natural ingredients. And it re actually really worked. It was fantastic. There was, you know, overnight um, improvement. And it continued to be a, a management strategy for her daughter's skin. Ruth, tell us a little bit about living with eczema and how it affects both your physical and mental well-being. Yeah, it really can, when it's flaring, affect every aspect of your life from not having a good night's sleep because you're scratching in the night to then trying to hide it, manage it all through the day. Everything from trying to cook, wearing gloves to chop vegetables, washing up, wearing gloves, wearing gloves to drive your car sometimes. Everywhere you go, you feel like it's visible. People can see it and people often do comment on it. So it kind of affects everything from your emotional well-being to how you feel. We've just got an idea there, haven't we, Ruth, of how challenging it can be and important to work. And um, when you've got somebody who's got eczema, you know, with, treat them with empathy, with understanding and support. How have you, as Balmonds, worked to improve the quality of life of people living with the condition? We want to create a community. We work on social media to represent the people who use our products. We, we talk about real skin. We represent real skin um, on our promotional materials. We don't want flawless, you know, there's no such thing as flawless skin, but we, we, do, we don't do airbrushing. Um, and that's really important, I think, for people's mental health and well-being to see themselves represented. And we're totally committed to doing that. And from your point of view, Ruth, how important is it that you have a sort of holistic approach to eczema? It's really, really important because it's not, it wasn't until like in my older years that I realized that my skin and how I felt about it was wrapped up so much emotionally. I just didn't realize that I'd buried all this shame and guilt from those early memories of being smacked when I was scratching and told not to. Mm -hmm. you, you then just hide your scratching and you hide the, the guilt and the shame away. Don't talk to people about it. And it's, it's really damaging that you feel like it's your fault that you have this skin condition. And if only people had talked to me about that when I was younger, like asked me how I felt about my skin and helped me find ways to manage it, finding natural products to help me rather than these big tubs of lardy, greasy stuff. It's like a bit of self-care, put mm -hmm. something nice on my skin that's actually promoting healing as well as moisturising and soothing. Lucy, it's great to see natural products available for people with skin conditions. Looking ahead, what yeah. things are you planning? Continuing our support and representation of the community, I think, is really important. We're looking to um, expand across the world because really my ultimate goal is for everybody who needs skin salvation to be able to get it. I want there to be proper, effective alternatives available um, so that so there is that. And we are going through the process of registering skin salvation as a medical device. Once we've done that, hopefully that will reassure dermatologists and GPs, healthcare professionals, that uh, it is a real valid research-based alternative to standard emollients and that it, you know, that it works and that people are happy to use it. Lucy, thank you very much indeed for joining me and Ruth as well. Thank, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thanks.